Um, first, thank you to the audience. You know, uh, Sideshow has never had the widest audience, but it is one of the most passionate. Uh, <laughs> Show, um, titled show about it's better to be nine people's favorite thing than a hundred people's ninth favorite thing. Um, and that they, you know, also, uh, there's a, you know, there's a, a great collection of uh, producers and investors here. So first, I want to say, oops, sorry. No, uh, <laughs> no I mean, it, it led by our our very very. Um, talented and relentless lead producers. They have been so incredibly generous. Um, I'm sorry that it turned more into philanthropy than business, but, but uh, thank you for leading with your heart. You know. <laughs> a, a big thank you to the G. Jackson Theater for giving us this jewel of a theater. Uh, the St. James is famous for having the best crew on Broadway and having to got to know the people backstage, front of the house. They live up to their reputation. Uh, a big shout out to our stage management team, all of the great creative collaborators who are not here today to help create the, to help create the show over the last few months, and Sam Davis and that incredibly hot band that was got Now, just a few words about this cast. Um, I have to say, it's not that these actors are, are um, playing roles in this production. They're completely reflected in the production. They created this production. Um, it's true of all of the leading players, but absolutely everybody on this stage. You know, a, a day I'll never forget is when we got together and everyone came in with the story of how they had wound up in Sir's sideshow. They were unbelievably personal and moving and magnificent and they they you know suggested the connection that everyone has to this material you know um, I think uh, there's nobody who's really dead center in this cast you know, everyone's a little odd um, <laughs> you know, left of center whatever um, and, and um, I think it's what makes them so connected not only to the production but also to each other and and I have to say that um, you know uh, I think they understand as well as anybody that with joy does come pain and loss you know and I really um, I think all of us feel you know great awe of your talent great love but also incredible admiration for the way that you guys have stepped up in the last month since our closing was announced <laughs> Today, that was the best of all. Finally, I want to end where it started. Um, with the, the beating heart of this musical, Bill Russell and Henry Ford. took a moment to process it, but I think I speak for everybody when the second thing we all thought about was, oh my God, Henry and Bill have to go through this again. <laughs> um, but I, I, I just want to remind you of something that I hope that you know, which is that um, while Sideshow may not yet have cracked the commercial code uh, for a big audience, it is, to quote a critic, it does now stand in, in the pantheon of great American <laughs> of your, your music is something that's going to be shared by countless directors and actors and musicians and designers and stage people for generations to come. So all I can say on behalf of all of us, I think on behalf of the audience, thank you for Sideshow.
basic rule of musicals, I think, that um, a song, you know, it, it, a, in a good musical, a song happens when you come to that point when you can no longer speak. So I think we're at that point. Sam? <laughs> Yes, you were told you won't. Now you're finally free to go. Say goodbye to the sideshow. Stop us from 